Far beyond the familiar warmth of our sun, Neptune drifts in the remote reaches of the solar system, a colossal, enigmatic world cloaked in deep blue. Nearly three billion miles from Earth, Neptune exists in a realm of endless twilight, where sunlight is so scarce that even midday feels like perpetual dusk. Here, the boundaries of what we know begin to blur, and the unknown takes center stage. Neptune's blue isn't the tranquil shade of Earth's seas. It's a wild, electric blue, shaped by the most ferocious winds in the solar system. These gales roar at speeds over 1-200 miles per hour, sculpting clouds of methane ice into ever-changing, chaotic forms. Immense storms, some dwarfing our entire planet, erupt and fade in the blink of an eye, leaving behind only fleeting shadows. For generations, Neptune was a mere whisper in the night sky, a planet first imagined through mathematics before it was ever seen. Astronomers noticed Uranus's orbit behaving strangely, and through careful calculation, they predicted Neptune's presence. When a telescope finally revealed it in 1846, it was a triumph of human curiosity, a world discovered by intellect before sight. On Neptune, the sun is nothing more than a distant, bright pinprick, barely offering any warmth. Temperatures plummet to nearly 370 degrees Fahrenheit, making Neptune one of the coldest places in our solar system. Its atmosphere glows with an eerie blue, lit by the faintest sunlight, casting a haunting and surreal beauty across the planet. Only one spacecraft, Voyager 2, has ever visited, racing past in 1989 and gifting us our first close-up of Neptune's turbulent majesty. In a fleeting encounter, Voyager 2 captured images and data that forever changed our understanding, revealing swirling storms and mysterious rings that had never been seen before. Neptune is a giant, four times wider than Earth, with gravity that crushes and an atmosphere of hydrogen, helium, and methane. Its immense mass creates a world where the air is thick and wild, and the planet's signature blue comes from methane filtering out the red light, leaving only the blue to shine back at us. Beneath Neptune's clouds lies a strange, slushy mantle of ices, water, ammonia, and methane, swirling in a superheated high-pressure state that defies easy explanation. Deep within, a rocky core may burn as hot as 9,300 degrees Fahrenheit, a hidden furnace beneath the planet's frozen exterior. Neptune remains a cosmic riddle, its secrets locked away in the darkness. Its remoteness makes it one of the least explored worlds, challenging our technology and imagination. Each glimpse we catch only deepens the sense of mystery. Orbiting Neptune is a collection of 14 known moons, each with its own story. Their orbits are tilted and strange, shaped by Neptune's powerful gravity and the echoes of ancient collisions. The largest, Triton, is a frozen world of nitrogen geysers and icy plains. Triton's backward orbit hints at a dramatic past. It may have been captured from the Kuiper belt, its surface marked by geysers that spray dark streaks across the ice. Neptune also boasts faint, clumpy rings, arcs of dark material unlike any others in the solar system. Their origins remain a puzzle, possibly the shattered remnants of ancient moons, ground to dust by Neptune's relentless pull. This distant realm serves as a natural laboratory, helping us unravel how planets form and change. By studying Neptune and its moons, we gain insight into the forces that shape worlds both near and far, from our solar system to distant exoplanets. Every observation, every new discovery, adds a piece to the puzzle of our solar system's farthest frontiers. Astronomers use powerful telescopes and ingenious methods to pry open Neptune's secrets, each finding bringing us closer to understanding our place in the universe. Then, on August 27, 2025, our most advanced telescope turned its gaze to Neptune and witnessed something extraordinary. A phenomenon never before seen appeared in Neptune's atmosphere, igniting excitement and debate among scientists everywhere. Suddenly, the silent, distant world was thrust into the spotlight. Neptune was no longer just a world of whispers. It had a story to shout, one that would reverberate across the solar system. The secrets of Neptune were on the verge of revelation. After ages hidden in darkness, the mysteries of this blue giant were finally stepping into the light, promising discoveries that would reshape our understanding of the cosmos. 
To see the invisible, we needed a new kind of eye, the James Webb Space Telescope. With its golden mirrors and massive sun shield, Webb orbits the sun at L2, a million miles from Earth. Its infrared vision pierces cosmic dust, revealing the universe's secrets in heat and ancient starlight. Webb has shown us the earliest galaxies, sniffed exoplanet atmospheres, and revealed new details of our own solar system. Its clarity turns fuzzy points of light into dynamic worlds. Webb's mission, uncover the origins of our universe and our place within it. The outer planets, like Neptune, are perfect targets for Webb's infrared gaze. During a routine observation, Webb and its science team stumbled upon something extraordinary on Neptune. Something completely unexpected was happening. Astronomers were meticulously analyzing Webb's latest data from Neptune's southern hemisphere, poring over every detail with keen interest and anticipation. Suddenly, without any warning, a region of Neptune's atmosphere erupted in a brilliant burst, an intense flash of thermal energy that lit up the cosmos. Was it a glitch? The question lingered. But no, every meticulous check confirmed it. The event was undeniably real and unprecedented. Webb had captured the unmistakable signature of a colossal impact. Something massive, perhaps an asteroid or comet, had slammed into Neptune with incredible force. The energy released was staggering, outshining the planet in infrared light. News of this cosmic event spread rapidly across the globe, capturing imaginations. Telescopes worldwide turned their gaze to Neptune, hoping to catch a glimpse of the aftermath and gather more data on this extraordinary event. It was pure luck. If Webb had been focused elsewhere, we'd have missed this monumental event entirely, a chance encounter with cosmic history. For the first time, humanity had a front row seat to a violent impact shaping a giant planet, offering insights into planetary dynamics. Unlike the predicted Shoemaker-Levy 9 event on Jupiter, this was a total surprise, an unexpected visitor from the depths of space. An object from the dark, mysterious outer solar system had struck Neptune, unannounced, leaving scientists in awe and wonder. The detection marked the start of a thrilling scientific race to understand what had happened. Neptune's quiet was shattered and the quest for answers had begun. Webb watched as the blinding flash evolved into a complex scene. The impact site ballooned into a massive, glowing plume of hot methane and hydrogen. As the plume cooled, it fell back, leaving a sprawling, dark scar, unlike Neptune's usual storms. Webb's instruments detected silicates and carbon compounds, evidence of the vaporized impactor. Shockwaves rippled through Neptune's atmosphere, disrupting jet streams and spawning new storms. Even Neptune's rings showed subtle changes, as material blasted outward was captured in orbit. Webb witnessed a world and its environment being violently transformed in hours. This was planetary change in real time. The data was unprecedented. What hit Neptune? The leading suspect, a comet from the Kuiper Belt or Oort Cloud. These icy bodies sometimes get nudged toward the giant planets. A comet's mix of ice, dust, and rock matches Webb's chemical findings. Another possibility, a centaur asteroid, denser and rockier, delivering a more powerful punch. The flash's brightness hints at a dense object, but the debate rages on. Some even suggest a rogue moon or an interstellar visitor. By analyzing the debris, scientists hope to identify the culprit. A city killer by Earth standards, but just a scar for Neptune. This is cosmic detective work, reconstructing distant events from light and chemistry. The impact's aftermath is still unfolding, and Webb is chronicling Neptune's transformation. The impact scar, a swirling vortex of debris, is being stretched and twisted by fierce winds. Scientists are watching it deform and disperse, learning about Neptune's atmospheric dynamics. The injected heat has created a giant hotspot, disrupting the planet's energy balance and spawning new storms. Neptune's moons may have been dusted by debris, subtly altering their surfaces. For Triton, it's a reminder of the violent environment of the outer solar system. Neptune has become a living laboratory, its recovery offering insights into planetary science. Each new web image adds to the puzzle. We're watching a planet heal and adapt in real time. The data will inform science for decades. The solar system is not static. It's dynamic, evolving, and sometimes violent. And we're lucky enough to witness it. 
This discovery changes everything we thought we knew about the outer solar system. For decades, astronomers believed this distant region was a place of calm, a quiet frontier where the drama of planetary formation had long since faded into history. We believed this region was quiet, its violent past long over. The giant planets, especially Neptune, seemed to drift in a peaceful orbit, untouched by the chaos that once shaped them. But this recent impact proves that major collisions still happen, even in these remote reaches. The outer solar system is not as settled as we once thought. The Kuiper Belt, a vast ring of icy bodies beyond Neptune, may be far more chaotic and dynamic than we ever imagined. These collisions can have real lasting consequences for the giant planets and their moons, altering their orbits and even their atmospheres. This event is a live demonstration of planetary accretion in action, showing us in real time how worlds continue to grow by sweeping up smaller bodies, just as they did billions of years ago. The debris from this collision gives us a rare, direct sample of the solar system's original building blocks, offering clues to the materials that form the planets. It's like finding a fresh fossil from the dawn of time, a preserved remnant that can reveal secrets about our solar system's earliest days. The implications for life elsewhere are profound. Moons with hidden oceans, like Europa or Enceladus, could be sterilized by such impacts, or perhaps even seeded with the ingredients for life, delivered by these cosmic collisions. Our scientific models will now be recalibrated with this real-world data, helping us better predict the future of our solar system and understand its past. Every surprise from the universe is a new opportunity to learn, to challenge our assumptions, and to expand our understanding of the cosmos. This collision is more than just a dramatic event. It's an explosion of new knowledge, forcing us to rethink the powerful forces that continue to shape our solar system even today. Why does a distant impact matter to us? Because curiosity is at the core of who we are. Looking up connects us to a story bigger than ourselves, a cosmic narrative. We build telescopes like Webb to expand our perspective and remind us we're part of an active, interconnected universe. The same forces that shape Neptune shape Earth. Understanding them helps us understand our own world. Exploration is an act of hope and an investment in the future. Each discovery inspires the next generation to ask questions and seek answers. Science is a relay race. We pass the baton of knowledge forward. The more we learn about harsh, distant worlds, the more we appreciate our fragile oasis. Our journey to the stars is also a journey back home, with a renewed sense of wonder and responsibility.